They're in the gate. And they're off. Toward the inside, Mulberry Street, an oncoming train, 90s country, Mr. Halftime. They move across the gap and head to the main track, and it's Thunderheart who comes away with the lead. Hometown Hero up into second now. Oncoming train backs off into third. Mr. Halftime fourth inside of an on-the-move 90s country. The trailer is Mulberry Street. Down the back stretch. Thunderheart short lead. Hometown Hero hounding every step of the way so far. They went that opening quarter in just 23 and 2. On to the far turn, Thunderheart the leader. Hometown Hero is right there, a stalking second. And 90s Country is three wide and on the pace while third. Oncoming train tucked away in behind fourth and only two lengths off the lead. Mulberry Street is coming on the run now, angling to the far outside. Off the turn, Hometown Hero takes the lead, top of the stretch. Thunderheart is back into second. Oncoming train bottled up in behind. Angles over toward the rail. One for long to go. Hometown Hero, the leader. Oncoming train is an oncoming second. Time is running out, though. And Hometown Hero is finishing strong. Hometown Hero, two lengths in the end. Oncoming train was second. It's tight for third. 90s country or Thunder heart. They're in the gate. And they're off. Frosted Diamond made a left-hand turn coming out of the starting gate. Does Amina Empire off near the back? Jin and Sin strikes out for the lead and Solid Tune is there and Divine Hope from the far outside. Solid Tune steps out from the extreme outside to grab a narrow lead as they race up the chute and they come for the main track. So it is Solid Tune in front. One full moon comes on to be second. Divine Hope up and on the pace. Three wide third. Jin and Sin toward the rail. Out in fourth is Amana Empires. Now fifth. Two and a half lengths off the lead. Three lengths back to Lamasco. Advancing up into sixth. Sweet Truffle seventh. On the move is Frosted Diamond. Lanterns Candy at the back of the first flight. And completely outrun so far is Dingle Harbor. The opening quarter in 23 and 2 to a sharp path in 46 and 3. Pace is honest enough. One full moon on through to grab a narrow lead. Solid Tune moves with that one. Divine Hope is three wide in right there. Zamina Empire's asked to pick it up fourth and toward the rail. Meanwhile, Lanterns Candy is launching a bid while wide, and Frosted Diamond's in with a shot as well. Top of the stretch, Solid Tune is back in front. But here comes Divine Hope. Divine Hope is coming after Solid Tune. These two head and head. Lanterns Candy third, down to the final 16th. Divine Hope has taken over. Solid Tune back to second. Lanterns Candy, Frosted Diamond chasing Divine Hope. Upset winner, 20 to 1 on the wire. Three lengths, Divine Hope won it. Solid Tune, second, Lanterns Candy, and Frosted Diamond. They're in the gate, and they're off. Little Tootsie and the Mary Rose will secret in from the outside, Sylvia Q. Rock's Princess settles in at the back early on. Up the chute they go. The Mary Rose, Lil Tootsie joined by Will Secret and Sylvia Q. The four of them are across the track as they transition to the main circuit. A break of five back to Rock's Princess, who lets the other four do battle. And do battle they do. 23 seconds flat for that opening quarter. Five for longs to go. The Mary Rose through to the inside for a short lead. Lil Tootsie is right there. Will Secret has backed off into third, trying to catch up. Sylvia Q is advancing down toward the rail. Heading past the half-mile pole. Here's the half-mile time, 45 and 4. Lil Tootsie is pressing the Mary Rose for the lead, and now these two stride out together. They're four lengths ahead of Will Secret, and then it's Sylvia Q and Rock's Princess. So round the far turn, the Mary Rose, short lead. Lil Tootsie right there, head and head for the lead. Will Secret, five lengths back in third. Rock's Princess and Sylvia Q. 
They're off the turn. They're into the stretch. Little Tootsie's off the turn in front. In front by three. Will Secret second. The Mary Rose has given way. Rock's Princess is now third. One for long to go. Little Tootsie, four length lead. Will Secret, Rock's Princess. Little Tootsie. Ambles home to the wire, the winner by four. And Rock's Princess might have got second. It's tight there with Will's secret, Sylvia Q, and the Mary Rose checks in fifth. And they're off. Maya's Wish and Tis Miss Betty, Sweet Beauty sent on for speed, no grants and perfect mistress on the far outside. Up the chute to the main track they go, no grants, short lead, Sweet Beauty keeping pace at the rail, and Perfect Mistress is right up and on the pace on the outside third. Tis Miss Betty drafting in behind while fourth, Olivia's Joy moves up to her outside into fifth. Glimpse Muse is back in sixth, and Maya's Wish the trailer. Sweet Beauty on through to the lead with four for longs to go. Half length advantage over No Grats in second. They went that opening quarter in 22 and four fifth seconds. Far turn. Sweet Beauty short lead. Perfect Mistress revving up on the outside. And here's Perfect Mistress looking for the lead and taking over midway round the far turn. And Sweet Beauty tries to go with her. Klimt's Muse is rallying now. Third on the outside. No Gretz gives way fourth. Off the turn. Perfect Mistress short lead. Sweet Beauty set down for the drive. Klimt's Muse is third. Eighth pull now. Perfect Mistress still in front. Sweet Beauty battles on toward the rail. Perfect Mistress short lead. Sweet Beauty continues to fight. Klimt's Muse is third. Down to the wire. And it will be Perfect Mistress. Length and a half in the end. Sweet Beauty was second. Klimt's Muse was third. Tight for fourth there among Tis Miss Betty, Olivia's Joy, and No Grats. They're in the gate, and they're off. The judge and jury caught a flyer from that inside post. Futuro with some speed, too, and Bar on the beach is not far behind either. In fact, Burr on the Beach has come away with the lead as they cross over to the main track. The judge and jury second down toward the rail. Young Turk comes away third. Uncle Nick is racing fourth. When in Rome on the move inside fifth. Four lengths back. Double dealer advancing up into sixth. Passing Futuro, who's now seventh. Versatile's eighth. Bright Spark ninth. Big red, white, blue tenth and toward the rail. Five back to Mad Magic. The trailer in a strung out field. Fifteen from top to bottom. The opening quarter goes in 22 and four. Bar on the beach. Steps out to lead by a length and a half with three for lungs to go. Young Turk comes on to grab second. The judge and jury is back third toward the rail. When in Rome is under pressure fourth. Double dealer comes alive with an inside run. Only four lengths behind and a quarter mile to go. Top of the stretch. Bar on the beach in deep water. Here's Young Turk. The judge and jury pops out. Double dealers weaving through the pack. Needs to find a way through. One furlong to go. Young Turk and the judge and jury. Double dealer forced to the outside. 16th remaining. The judge and jury. Young Turk. Double dealer. Down to the wire. The judge and jury. Maybe. Head bobbing finish. Good bob for the judge and jury. Young Turk was right there. Double dealer third. They're in the gate and they're off. Soros breaks on top in West Warpath with some speed. Notable exception for that outside post. And Red Knobs is up close too. Into the clubhouse turn, and it's Soros who steps out to lead. And angles over toward the inside. Notable exception comes on to be second, and Red Knobs is right up there third. West Warpath shuffled back toward the rail. Ismian moves up a couple of spots up into fourth. West Warpath is back into fifth. Malibu time is racing sixth, and Mount Kenya is wide at the back in seventh. Six lengths off the lead. Soros's quarter was 24 seconds flat, and he's now joined by Notable Exception. So these two will share the lead down the backstretch run, and they are tracked by another pair. 
Ismian, and Red Knobs. They're together third and fourth. Mount Kenya has made progress up to be fifth, within four lengths of the lead for the final half mile. The opening half of the race was 48 and 1. Soros is back in front. Notable exception is still right there, though. These two won two round the turn. Red Knobs is right in behind, racing third. Mount Kenya, steady and gradual progress up to be third on the outside. Red Knobs back to fourth. Ismian gives way fifth. Top of the lane. Soros set down for the drive. Comes a little bit wide off the turn, but in front of length and a half. Notable exception is there. Red Knobs is rolling up the rail. Here comes Red Knobs after Soros. Soros short lead. Red Knobs finishing fast. Notable exception back to third. Soros is still there. Red Knobs can't get by. Soros the winner. Wire to wire over Red Knob second that it was either Notable Exception or Ismian. And they're in the gate. And they're off. My, my money, ring me, darling, and busy echo on the rise from the far outside showing speed as well. Busy Echo steps out to lead. Shell Shock comes through toward the rail. Ring Me Darling is there. My My Money on the outside and up close fourth. Four across the track early. A length and a half back to Sparkle of Hope, who comes on to be fifth on the rise is sixth. Designed by Kitten, angles over toward the rail. Seventh, Legerity is eighth. And Sweet Confusion, the trailer. Half mile to go. Busy Echo bounding along through a quarter in 22 and three. On to the far turn in front by length and a half. Now it's a length as My My Money gets closer from second. And Ring Me Darling smack dab between them. Sparkle of Hope comes on four wide. Sparkle of Hope revving up with a wide sweeping move. On the rise follows that one. Shell Shock in behind. Legerity's on the scene as well. Off the turn into the stretch. Ring Me Darling. Short lead heading for the eighth pole. Sparkle of Hope attacks on the outside second. These two, one, two for long to go, and Ring Me Darling turns back Sparkle of Hope. Ring Me Darling kicks away, spurts away by three. Full of run is she. Ring Me Darling, ready to run today. Sparkle of Hope was second. Legerity was third. On the rise was fourth. There in the gate, and they're off. Overtaxed is sent on for speed right off the mark. Goodnight comes on through with an early challenge as well as the field races up the chute and Bird and Hunk of Love joins them. Crossing over, overtaxed the leader. Bird and Hunk of Love racing in second. Goodnight tucked away toward the rail third. Hoist the gold comes away fourth. Break a two to my prankster and Tejano twist the trailer. Overtaxed a leader down the back stretch. Leads by a length heading for the far turn. Burn and Hunk of Love is prompting in second through an opening quarter in just 23 seconds flat. Overtaxed, heads for the far turn, the leader. Bird and Hunk of Love second. Goodnight is right there, third toward the rail. Nowhere to go just yet. Hoist the gold, rallies up on the far outside. Tejano twist behind that one. My prankster, the trailer, at the quarter pole, the leader is over Tex, top of the lane. An opening down inside for Gunite and Gaffleone comes on through. Here comes Gunite with a covert move down toward the rail. Hoist the gold, finishing with him. Tejano twist by Prankster. One for long to go. Gunite is tested. Hoist the gold. Here's my Prankster late on the scene. Gunite, hoist the gold. My Prankster, Gunite is determined. Good night would not be denied. My prankster and hoist the gold ran at him, and he still won. Tejano Twist was fourth. They're in the gate. And they're off. Bank comes blasting out of there. AC Expressway hustled on for speed from the outside as well as they race up the chute. 
Banks in front. Much better comes on through to challenge for that lead as well. Devil's Tower down toward the inside in that early mix too. As they move up the backstretch run, Verbs right there racing fourth. Country comes away fifth. AC Expressway far outside in sixth. Coltonator comes on to grab seventh and ready to pounce his eighth and toward the rail. Strong Constitution's ninth, but only five lengths off the lead. The trailer is Bourbon calling. Far turn run. Much better goes head to head with Devil's Tower. Much better. Puts a nose in front with three for longs to go. Bank is pushed on to the outside while third. Wide trip for AC Expressway. Fourth. Verb in behind fifth and starting to run on. Ready to pounce as saving ground needs to find a way through down toward the rail. Kadri comes wide off the turn. Top of the stretch. Much better's in front. In front by two. Verb to the attack. So two bank. Ready to pounce. Bourbon calling. Appears on the scene. Late in the game. Ace the expressway finishing with interest too. Wide open, 16th to go. Verbs in front, ready to pounce. AC Expressway and Bourbon calling. Here's the wire. Ready to pounce. Got it. Up the inside to do it. AC Expressway, Bourbon calling, and Verb in a photo for second, third, and fourth. And they're off. Seal Beach is hustled out of there. So, too, is Drink the Wind. American Mayhem showing speed as well. Up the chute, and for the main track, they go. And American Mayhem to go head-to-head -head with Drink the Wind early. Seal Beach, a perfect tracking trip of the outside third. Anarchist advancing toward the rail fourth. Thatches now fifth. Edge of Glory moves up into sixth. Raise the roof, Charlie down inside, moving along from 7th Mount Kisco, 8th, Film Star back in ninth. three lengths back, Bold Lookers in 10th, Cyclone 11th by 2, and Stand for Freedom, the trailer, heading for the far turn, the opening quarter in 22 and 4, American Mayhem, the leader, right there is Drink the Wind. And Seal Beach is revving up three wide. Anarchist down toward the rail in fourth. Thatch going the wrong way. Edge of Glory film star mustering up late rallies. Cyclone angles to the outside. Raised a roof. Charlie comes off the rail. Six lengths to make up there. Top of the lane. Drink the wind in front. Here comes Seal Beach. Seal Beach attacks from the outside. American Mayhem back into third. One for long to go. Drink the wind trying to fend off Seal Beach. But Seal Beach grabs the lead at the 16th and strides away. Seal Beach under the wire to win it by four in the end. And it's very tight for second. Bold Looker was there. Drink the wind was there. Stand for Freedom was there. And Cyclone was there too.